It has been few days Apple has released iOS 13 beta. Since then, users have been reporting issues they found and Apple has been fixing them. I feel now is the right time for you guys to install iOS 13 beta on your iPhones and iPads because major bugs have been fixed. In this video, I'll tell you how to install iOS 13 beta and also how can you go back to the official version when it is out. Make sure you watch this video till the end. Now, let's look at this list of devices that support iOS 13. If you have any of these devices, then you can follow the instructions. Here I have iPad Pro 10.5 which is running on iOS 12.3. Now let's install iOS 13 on this. This installation process will be the same for all iPhones and iPads. Open Safari and go to beta.apple.com. Then sign in with your Apple ID and accept the terms and conditions. Then click on enroll your device. It tells you to backup all your data and you should. Scroll down, click on download profile. Hit allow to download. Go to settings, general, profile, tap on the profile and click install. Then enter your passcode, hit install again. It will ask you to restart, go ahead and restart. Once the device is restarted, go to settings, general, software updates and you should see iOS 13 beta update available for you. Make sure you have 50% of the battery left and you are connected over Wi-Fi to download the update. As you can see, now we are on iOS 13. If you want to go back to official version when Apple releases the public version of iOS 13, all you need to do is check for updates and install the update. You will no longer be on beta. But if you still find yourself stuck in beta, you can go to settings, general, profile and delete the profile. Restart your device. Check for updates again and you should see official iOS update available for download. If you have any questions, please drop a comment. I'll be happy to answer them. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I'll see you on the next one. Until next time, take care.